Dear Apex Legends, I want you to know that I'm saying this because we care about you, but it is time for you to wake up. It's time to do something. It's time to wake up. It's time to get active. Genuinely speaking, I love playing this game and I'm still making content today because I want this game to thrive. But this letter towards you is not to send hate. It's not to say that I'm done with you. It's just to say that I know you could do better. So consider it love that I love you enough to tell you when you're doing something wrong. So dear Apex, we know that when we look at the season 15 stats, a lot of people weren't excited for it. Matter of fact, people are playing more today during the collection event than they were at the start of season 15, which brought a brand new map and a new legend. So keep in mind, there's more people playing a recycle event that got double ratioed over on youtube than there were at the start of the new season despite what all the haters say we know this game's not dead and we know it's not going to die anytime soon we can all mutually agree to ignore the people not making any sense the people that are voicing their concerns have great reason to do so we've seen the people that are the most positive in the community never trying to say a bad thing about apex legends finally during this time of year say that apex needs to step it up so apex consider your truly beloved staycation someone who has probably never mentioned a bad thing about this game and probably the most positive guy in the community everyone loves staycation if there's one guy and youtuber you can trust for your game it is staycation and he even said apex currently is not it for the first time i refuse to buy everything because i already own the different recolors of the same exact items i want to be excited but i also won't lie to myself good for you stay if that wasn't enough even tsm Janie saying i'll be honest there's no game like apex which we all can agree to this game is fun at its core but i'm getting tired of the recycled modes and skins again and again and again with just small adjustments and with retrospect bringing a light that there's no really adjustments at all they're just recycled skins with new colors it's just ridiculous it's time to call you out on it because we're tired of it and while we're at it let's call out the people that are still oddly defending this behavior so dear apex take example number three of this poor innocent soul that you've brainwashed that used to work over at ea that actually thinks this is an appropriate response to thornton smash's tweet only three weeks more of winter express and apex legends being sarcastic saying time is limited so if you need to get those skins that will come back in the store three months from now the price now is your only chance to pay double so hurry up and despite not even working for ea you've done such a good job brainwashing this poor innocent fella that he's still sticking up for you and dear apex keep in mind this is the same guy that called you out during the cross progression fiasco responding to fans saying don't even worry about cross progression because it's not going to be set up the way that you want it to you buy as well just go ahead and start your new account on the new pc dear apex that's despite you promising it was coming this year and what's with your developers thinking it's a big joke about how hated this collection event was throwing shade at the people that got the chrome extension to see how many dislikes were on the trailer would it just be better to sweep it under the rug and not talk about the fans frustrations was marvel right to reply that i'm just going to ignore the community's feedback because my game is flawless and it is the community who is wrong and not our team for dropping the ball or this guy that just suggests that he's mad because the trailer didn't do well dear apex what happened to you why have you changed your ways and priorities why was the content better during pandemics and less staff and why are you forcing these skins to be bought with pack bundles so that people have to pay more not only did you get ratioed terribly on your youtube collection event trailer but even people yesterday over on your twitter page as you tweeted about the fan favorite winter express mode yesterday thinking this would do numbers but rather it did a lot of ratio numbers 2,000 likes you got but his watson comes in with 5k likes saying recycled content plus ratio garrett leaks also ratioed you a lot of other people tried to ratio but it's very obvious the community is not so happy apex what happened to the time when people got frustrated and used to come out and say we understand the frustrations we've heard you loud and clear here's what we're doing to make the changes what happened to every time an outrage was going on that did a lot of numbers you responded and consoled or at least gave an explanation as to what was going on let me wrap this letter up like this dear apex we love you we love everything about the core mechanics of this game and would like to continue playing it for years to come we probably Probably will continue to play it for years to come but it's moments like this that force you to be in a position to grow people are tired of taking no answer for an answer we want to see and we want to hear what you've been up to is there anything that's actually exciting that's worth looking forward to could you please hype us up at least the slightest yesterday we found that your competitor fortnite seems to be adding wall running to their game i don't think anyone really cares about fortnite or wall running it's just the fact that they're getting something that is unbelievably different as much as i don't like that game i can look over there 
there and say they are always trying to mix it up. You, on the other hand, are not. You found a formula that worked a couple years ago and have abused it to no end. And we want something more. We want something different. The people have spoken. It is the numbers that are doing the speaking, not just people on Twitter complaining at this point. Trust me, the reason we complain is because we have your best interest in mind. Not many people are complaining because they genuinely hate this game. They're complaining because they want to see this game thrive like no other. Take this for what you will, but consider it signed by most of the people watching this video. Thank you everyone for watching the video. I know not everyone will agree. I know not everyone will like this video. I do feel like it was something that needed to be said, and this is the most creative way I could do it. And I know this is not a normal J Miles video, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Later, Gators.